thanks for staying with us. In today's digital age, our smartphones are our lifeline mm -hmm. to the world. But what happens when they encounter a glitch or suffer a cracked screen, for example? This morning, we're exploring the world of cell phone repairs and accessories with Stephen James, IT specialist formerly with the JDF Maritime Air and Cyber Brigade and the owner of iTech Repairs to learn how you can breathe new life into your beloved devices and discover the must-have accessories to enhance your mobile experience. Welcome to Sunrise, Stephen. How you do? I'm not doing too bad. Good morning. Good morning. Well, um, yeah, yeah, this is my kind of segment. I'm always <laughs> changing my phone cases. I'm always trying to protect the device as much as possible. There are different people, different people like different devices, so, um, different protection methods. Mm -hmm. Some people like the bulky case them. I don't like the bulky case them. Some people, you have to definitely, whether they like it or not, you have they to get them an the after box. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. What is the most in demand um, service that people come to you for? All right. Um, a lot of speed. persons, um, they come for repairs, like for physical damage mm -hmm. and uh, water damage, mm -hmm. as well as they come for phone case charger accessory and unlocking. And surprisingly people come, enough... People still come for unlock? Yes, definitely so. And um, unlocks is one of the most um, profitable part of the phone really? market right now. Have, yes. Oh, wow. Because um, mm. they have this thing that they call FRP, which factory, protect, um, factory protection. Factory reset protection. Yes, sorry. yes, yes. And um, with that, what it does, it actually locks the devices to the account now. Um, where I'm from, there's a lot of elderly persons that do have phones that what happens is they don't, they allow persons to set up the devices for them. Mm -hmm. So what happens is they change the yes. password one day, they don't remember it. So what happens is that they put in the password wrong so many times, mm. they get locked out. Right. Mm. So when they get locked out now, they wipe the devices. And when they wipe the devices, it's locked to the account, nobody knows it. So we have services that we offer that can get rid of those locks mm. as well. But the device has to be legit. Right. Yeah. Because right. we don't want to get T4 stolen devices and, yeah, yeah. and then they bring it to us and then you get the whole police vibe and mm -hmm. things. Yes. Yeah, yeah. You mentioned before about repairs and water damage. Mm -hmm. I'm a little triggered by that <laughs> statement as someone yeah. who's lost a phone to water. Mm -hmm. I can't just put the phone in rice. I need to just bring the phone that to you. Rice thing still. you see, it, 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 it is recommended that you bring the phone to the closest technician possible to get the water out of it. For example, salt water yeah. is very corrosive, and if you leave it in the device for a long while, put it in rice, it's going to actually allow the board to rust more, ah. and that won't actually save the device. Right? You have to get it put up, mm -hmm. um, get Dried the proper um, devices used to get mm -hmm. all the moisture out. Clean the board with contact cleaner or um, the board, yeah, contact cleaner, which is a board cleaner, mm -hmm. in order to not have that issue. And there's a high possibility at that time that you will get back your information. So if I, if my phone goes swimming, I just need to find Stephen as quickly as I possibly can. As quickly as you can. Mm -hmm. Where do mm -hmm. I find you? I am located on Whitehall Avenue in the vicinity of Swallowfield Primary. So it's a 12 a Whitehall Avenue, Kingston 8, directly in front of Lawrence Drive. I can't miss it. It's no, I know only, exactly where it is, yeah. It's, it's I know the only, exactly it's where it is. Only Red building with tiled walls in the area. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, definitely. What are some of the other things you have on offer? All right, then. Um, hold on, so hold on. Before you say, look at this. I, I, now, hold on now. I have one of these. Hold on. No, yeah. You have if one that, of these? That's a most, that this? Is a most no, of hold on this? I do. Mm -hmm. I don't have one. I mean, because if you can see this, this is, I mean, the old type of... Uh, the of USB. Yeah, the yeah, USB 2.0 right, or 3.0. The yeah. charger. But, I mean, you know, usually... It, but it has a Type C connection. Yeah, so you use this yeah. to connect your Samsung to your MacBook. That's why I have one of those. Mm -hmm. mm. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, because um, or what's happening? You could happening? just get an iPhone. Oh, hey, hey, <laughs> hey, Stephen, we're not gonna go there. Go ahead, you were saying. Yeah. So, um, for example, that um, device that you have right there, yeah. that small device. Mm -hmm. No, um, a lot of devices. No, new technology. Yeah, it's um, C to C. new connections, yeah. faster connection speed. So right now we have a Type C to Type C cable, right? Right. So call it. God forbid you forget your Type C brick, yes. yeah. right? And somebody you have this nice little contraption here. It allows you to use, make your device backward compatible to use the um, the oh, older yes. yeah. devices. So this, I believe, is one of the must have. Mm -hmm. Now you were speaking about iPhone just now. We have adapters for yeah, earphones yeah, yeah. because a lot of person don't like the iPhone earphones, so to speak. Yeah. Yeah. So you can always get the little adapter and mm -hmm. plug it in and it works. And we also have the same for the Samsung Galaxy because if you realize on a lot of devices now, the, the, um, the 3.5 millimeter jack mm -hmm. is no longer there. So for the iPhone, it's not yeah. there. Specialized yeah. headset for Samsung, it's not there because mm -hmm. you know the whole patenting mm -hmm. field did research on that. All right. All right. We're out of time. Thank right. you very much, Stop. Stephen. Yes. Stephen James has been our guest in this segment. TK is up with the news at 7. Really cool.